in the Northwestern Open Table Tennis Championships from the Paddle Palace in Portland, Oregon. On your left there in the dark blue is Sim Gallucci from Richland, Washington. And on the right, Portland, Oregon's Judy Bohensky, one of the top-rated players in the Northwest and, in fact, around the country, Jim. Yes, that's right. Judy's 24 years old from here in Portland. She's a number six U.S. woman player. She's the top woman player in Oregon. She's represented the United States in South Korea, Germany, USA Goodwill Games. She's been an intercollegiate champion in okay. 1979. Sim Gallucci is 30 years old. She was kind of embarrassed at admitting to us she was 30, but she's been in the United States about 10 years, originally Sim, from South Korea, possibly. married, has no kids, and she's the number five player it's in the Richland, Washington Hale. League. You win. What do you want to do? All right, the, uh, the umpire now, Jim Scott, has come out for the coin toss, okay. and uh, we will Ms. have Bohensky determined will momentarily who is serving, receiving, and all. which way they'll be playing to get the match underway. This, of course, is the, uh, the women's competition, women's open competition here at the Paddle Palace in Portland, Oregon. That is Sim Gallucci right there. This, is, by the way, is the final, the championship One match love. in this division. And the first two points as play is underway. Two Both go to love. Judy Bohensky on her own serve. Oh, nice smashing by Sim Gallucci. Judy, Judy is the... Uh, uh, favorite player in Two, this match. One. Sim has only been playing tournament competition uh, very recent months, although she learned how to play in the seventh and eighth grade when she was in Korea. 3 1 now in favor, in favor of Judy Bohensky. Three, uh, Sim one. told us before the match got underway that uh, her biggest problem she felt would be being nervous at the outset. And, uh, She's come out playing some nice offensive shots. She will now Two, take the serve, three. trailing 2 3. Let. Let ball struck the net and it becomes 2-4 uh, she's really trying to put a lot of spin two, on that serve four. Isn't she, Jim? yes she is that pinhole grip that Sim is using is uh, the preferred grip in the eastern countries uh, you only have rubber on one side of the racket it makes the racket two, lighter five. wrist motion uh, is much easier than it is with the shake hand grip the forehand smash is much easier to make, much Two, more smooth six. a stroke, but the backhand is weaker, so there are advantages and disadvantages to each grip. Judy Two, using the shake seven. hand again, and Sim using the eastern pinhole grip. Two, eight. The uh, change of serve now, and Judy Bohensky with the lead of 8-2. Uh, actually, eight, Judy has uh, been able to return virtually everything that's been hit at her so far in this match. That's Nine, right, she took five two. straight points off of Sim's serve, which is very unusual. Service is a very big advantage in the sport. And has run seven straight points right now. 10-2. It is 10-2. That went off the net. 11-2. 12-2. I think now it may be as Sim's nerves are showing up. I, I'm afraid so. If she looks over at that scoreboard right 12, now, it, uh, that two. would be enough to cause nervousness at this point. Nice angle shot by Sim. So Sim picks up a point there. It is now 3-12 three, three as she takes the service back. That went off the net, but long beyond the end of the table, 3-13. Sim has been playing three, the style 13. of game here. She's been hitting every ball flat, a little bit of top spin on it. Judy's been blocking the ball, just trying to keep it in play. Sim's having to take all Four, the chances with 13. those offensive shots. Oh, she missed her Four, own service. 4-14. 4-15. Judy just very much in Four, control of this match. 15. Judy is a blocker and a hitter, but she hasn't had to do much more so far than block, keep the ball in play, and wait for one of Sim's offensive shots. Normally, 15, Sim five. has hit the ball. It's caught the top of the net, which is just a very slight misjudgment, and uh, have gone off the 16, table. 5-16. Five. Five, Sim has almost reached the point now where uh, this one is so far gone. There's 5-17 that... Uh, it would 17, be almost better for her to five. try to start putting this one out of her mind and get ready for game number two and try to start all even and without any thoughts 18, of how badly this one five. went. That's right. Usually when I get in a position like this in a match, I usually try to go for the shots that I want to make in the next game. If I'm nervous, maybe I'll work it out a little bit because the game is gone 19, and you can try to get five. some of your momentum recovered. It is 519. That's 20. That is 20, and so Judy Bohensky of Portland, they're Five, facing us in 20. the light blue, is just one point away from winning it all. That makes it 6-20. She's still trying to Six, win this first 20. game. 
And there it is. 21 to 6. Judy Bohensky takes the first game of the women's championship finals here at the Northwestern Open. She leads one game to none for the title in the women's open division over Sim Gallucci. Here's a look now at that final game winning point in game one of the best of five, three out of five championship match at the Northwestern Open. And we'll have more of this great competition when we return on ESPN. Judy Bohensky has won the first game of the best three out of five set for the women's championship by a score of 21 to 6 over Sim Gallucci. And we are ready now for game number two. Sim in the dark blue on our right is serving. She's out of Richland, Washington, 30 years of age. And uh, right now in very Love deep one. trouble. And now this one becomes 1-1 one, one on Sim Gallucci's serve. One all. Oh, nice angle block by Judy. Judy has that capability of uh, playing almost any any type of shot One, to her and, uh, and making contact and keeping it in play. And as I say that, of course, she puts one into the net just to prove that everybody is not perfect. Exactly. 3-2. It is 3-2. Judy Bohensky now serving. A lot of spin on that one, and uh, Sim unable to Four, return two. it. 4-2. 5-2. Two. Two. She just changes pace so well, too. Yes, she does. Judy has uh, been playing much Five, longer than two. Sim has. Uh, has the shots down. The consistency is the main thing. Sim can hit shots. She's going three good offensive shots in a row. Judy finally missed a lob. But the, the difference in the last game Five, was not so three. much uh, who had the most power. It was just the consistency. Nice, strong backhand smash by Judy that time. That was power. That was the passing shot with great power. 6-3, Judy Bohensky. And... Uh, Cooling Six, herself, uh, using her racket as a fan. Oh, good return. Beautiful shot Sam. by Sam. Well placed, well thought out. She knew Four, where she wanted to six. go with that one, and she did. Oh, just barely missed that smash. The last game, Sim was trying to win by consistent Four, offense, seven. hitting every ball. And a couple of points ago, she hit two shots, got Judy back, dropped that short ball, won the point on an easy shot. Much, much better strategy. 5-7. Five, 5-7. Seven. Five, seven. Oh, missed her own service again. 5-8. A damaging point to lose. She loses two in a row now on her own service. It is 5-9. Five, 5-9. Nine. Five, nine. That is Judy Bohensky leading with her back to you in the near court. And the service is long. 5-10. That'll ten, turn over to 10-5, Judy Bohensky. 11-5, and Judy now starts 11, another run. Five. Jim, she did that in the first game and really put it away in the middle portion of the game, and here she goes. There's that beautiful smash by Judy. She hadn't had to use it so far. Her consistency had been enough, but she got 12, a shallow high ball, five. and she smashed it. 13-5. This is the Women's Open Championship game. This is the final 13, for the women. 13-5. Judy Bohensky and Sim Gallucci. The return by a Judy and Sim is unable to handle it. It becomes 14 to 5. 14 5. Well, she fails to win all five points of her serve, but she took four six, of the five 14. and leads four, uh, 6 14 now. Now, there's that backhand pinhole shot. Very difficult to reach around, almost six, behind 15. your body with the racket in your hand that way to make that shot. Well, Sim once again attacking at the net, but she put the ball into the net and trails now 6-16 after losing the first game. 6-16. 6-21. Judy that time going for a fairly Seven, low percentage 16. backhand, but she has enough cushion in the lead. Beautiful smash by Sim that time. Well, she seems to have recovered here in game two Eight, from the, 16, the great run by Judy Bohensky, which Sim did not do in the first 16, game. 16, 9. Oh, two good smashes by Sim. Three. Yeah, and she missed with that one. Tried to go for the angle, hit it a little too wide for the table. 17, 9. 17, 9. High toss serve by Judy. Handled well by Sim, but blocked out of reach by Judy. 18-9, and Judy Bohensky once again can win 18, this game, game nine. two, on her own serve. 19-9, she's very close. Nice top spin serve. 
20 to 9, and we come to game point now. Judy Bohensky of Portland there, nine. 24 years old, serving. And winning. 21 to 9 as she wraps Bohensky. up game number two. 21 to 9. Judy Bohensky, the game winner. She leads in games two to none. And here's another look at the final point. As Judy puts the ball across the net, and the return there by Sim Gallucci is long. Well, Jim Sim said that uh, her name, Bohensky, Sim, translates roughly into heart. Love and all. she may need all of that in game number three as Judy again uses her racket there to fan herself to keep cool. And here we go in the third game. Sim is playing some nice series of offensive shots. She can hit two or three in, but one, Judy keeps them coven. coming back, and Sim will eventually hit one that seems to take the top of the net and eventually go off. And there Judy hit one that took the top of the net and went off. 1-1 one, one is the score. But overall, one consistency off. seems to be in Judy Bohensky's favor in this contest. And again, it is Sim, who is long beyond the end of the table. 2-1, Two, Two, one. One, Judy Bohensky. The soft serve, the smash, caught the net. And fell in, very short, Three, bounced one. twice. Sim couldn't get there. Oh, nice hop. Judy put a little top spin on that backhand return lob and it hopped away from Sim's one, racket. Four. Sim wanted to go for the smash that time, but the ball just simply wasn't there when she came around with her racket. 1-5. This is one, the third five. game of the match. 1-6 with Judy Bohensky seemingly on her way to the women's championship here one, in Portland, six. Oregon. One seven. One seven. One eight. One eight. One nine, and the game just seems to have now deserted Sim Gallucci. Nine, She's having one. trouble just getting the ball over the net at this point. But now Judy hits one into the net, and it becomes two nine nine two. Nine two. Judy Ten, Bohensky, two. who represented the United States in South Korea, Germany, USA, Goodwill Games back in 1978. She's a member of the team that represented Eleven, the USA two. in the famous friendship matches in China back in 1971. She was Twelve, on that, that first team to go through the bamboo curtain to play table tennis and what a two, change that 13. made in the diplomacy of the world, and Judy was part of that. A net ball by Sim that time. So it is 313. 3-14. 3-15. 3-15 with Judy Bohensky leading. 4-15. One of Sim smashes that time paid off. 4-15. That would make it 4-16, and it'll become 16-4 now. Four. And Judy Bohensky could put this match away here on her own serve as she runs five straight points. Well, there's one of them. Uh, Sim just badly misplayed that ball, Jim. Well, she mishit it. 17. The ball hopped away Four. again, and it caught the edge of her racket, making it look like a, uh, a bad shot. But she didn't miss it far. But against 18. Judy Bohensky, Four. you don't have any margin for error at all the way she's playing in this match. No, not hardly. Sam, I think, is uh, 19 to 4 now. One of the top women players in the state of Washington. But she's coming up against Judy Bohensky, who has been to world four. championship after world championship, international competition. Match. And there it is. That's the match. The game. Judy Bohensky wins it 21 to 4 and wins the match in three straight games. Here's that winning point again. And you can see it was just as all of them in this match. It was Judy Bohensky placing the ball, forcing the error, and Sim Gallucci was simply not able to contain it. The Northwest Open from Portland, Oregon table tennis competition. We'll be back with more on ESPN.